Ladies and gentlemen, are you up to the challenge? Are you ready for it? And are you at your best? Yeah, the eclipse was weird. And life is getting weirder. It's okay, though. I got a feeling. It's now. On the side of the good guys. So that is great. We're looking at Comet R2. And are you ready for action? Because the sun is showing signs of activity again. We're talking about action on the sun's eastern limb. And how weird is it? Well, things are about to get very stormy and your government is going to shut down. So, that means guys like me and people like Dutch Sins, Suspicious Observers, W7, I don't know, does BP still cover weather? Um, Mr. BBB333, uh, Grand Solar Minimum, other people in the truth community, the lowest channel, uh, will be needed to help keep people on top of weather and earthquakes and space weather. Because one thing we learned, or I learned, during the tsunami warning that came and watched, that came for the entire Pacific American and Canadian West Coast is that our government shuts down and even when it's open it's not that functional because their tsunami site didn't work the entire time that the entire West Coast was under a Pacific uh, warning and watch meaning if a tsunami was going to hit the website wasn't working so people from Canada, Alaska Washington, Oregon, California, down in Mexico would have had no clue what was it coming when or where and what to expect so knowing what we know that the weather's been weird the last two years there's no reason to debate what's causing the weirdness we just know it's weird and um so we should probably get ready for it which reminds me like dude look at this this is weird this is the pressure on the world right now in this spot, the model's been getting wrong every day. You got three little low pressure spots. The white is high pressure, and the blue is low pressure. Usually, low pressure means bad weather. Speaking of bad weather, um, dang, I did not have that up properly. I'm sorry that I've let you down, but the universe is a three act structure, so I'll do my best to make it up to you. All right, so watch for black ice. 100, 100 degree temps from Ryan Maui in Africa. Dadabu, talking about the storm systems, multiple ones we got coming in. The king of weather, Twitter, talking about this storm coming up over the next three to four days, which could have a pretty dang st strong punch, but won't be the strongest of the entire bunch. Or the network, you have a hurricane looking vortex off the California coast. It's cute, isn't it? Yes. And those are two different days. The same spots are going to be getting creamed throughout here. Like with multiple rainstorms. I don't know. The one calculation is like five and 15 days or something. But that, that equals it's going to be a lot of rain, a lot of trouble, a lot of travel problems, stuff like that. And so. There's one thing I wanted to show you guys. Oh, and another thing is, by the way, Congress, President Trump, the Senate, the House, can y'all please make sure to make a bill making sure that the military, NOAA, NASA, and the weather workers all get paid? Well, you guys take your ball and go home. We have a printing press. You just borrow more money from the Fed. Do it real quick and make sure those people um, get paid. If you had to prioritize, and definitely the soldiers, I would never send soldiers out to fight a war. I'm not paying them all. You guys return to your pansy ass resort. Okay, sorry, I didn't mean to be a jerk. Okay, so. <laughs> she's so pretty. I'm sorry, I don't know what to do. She's just some about beautiful faces. Yeah, so we got a lot of severe weather. Red line. We got a lot of severe weather coming up. Um. I recommend you follow hashtag WX Twitter. Uh, they're the best, one of the best teams. They're 
Definitely during last hurricane season, they showed they worked together pretty selflessly in extreme conditions. So for up to the minute updates on Twitter, hashtag WX Twitter is the best to go to though. Twitter is bad for your brain. And oh, did you know I call the sun baby all the time and she doesn't seem to mind. Also horses, sometimes puppies, I call them babies. And so I was thinking about that comet earlier, remember? And it's almost like the trail, it's almost like if, as Earth revolves around, if you have electric connections, it's like, are these storms connected to some of these comets that we have coming in? Because R2 is just like the undercard for K2, but K2 is like five years away, which is strange in itself, but we can talk about that later. I don't want this video to get too long. So I'm going to tell you guys, hey, y'all, I'm back. It's about to be stormy. And it's going to get weird. And so, I still haven't found the one thing. I mean, we're, watch, we're watching these storms form pretty much the same pattern, see? And um, I think Texas will get at least a few more snow days before it's all said and done. We're almost there, I hope. And these are different storms that are seen on here. Oh, Daenerys. Like I said, pretty beautiful woman. What can I do? The tiger. They're singing a song in their rocket. The tiger. He destroyed his cage. Yes. Yes. The tiger is out. This is from a six-year-old. I thought it was pretty cool. This is not total doom by any means. But things are definitely going to get weird. Life might even become like a video game. It depends on how well we adapt to it. Government. <sighs> okay, where are we at? And the Dow, as you guys know, dropped 666 points. Technically 665, and then they rounded up. But Bitcoin, still within my margins. I think 65 is the lowest it would go. Unless there's a total crash, then you could see sub 100. Okay. Yeah, that's true. Okay, wait, what? See, there's our slash. It's going to be a heavy rainy. Oh, here it was. Come on, work for me, please. Oh, it's going to be too slow. You can do it. This video. This water looks to be about 12, 15, 20 feet high. And it's rushing through the city at about, I would guess, 45, 50 miles an hour. So it's like literally getting hit with a river. Um, I guess you'll have to, my name, at... Twitter is at New Thor. And, um, it's not going to work here, unfortunately. But yeah, this thing, like this water, this is in India. It seems to be about 15, 20 feet high. We're between 10 and 20 feet high. Dang it. And, uh, and it's going about 50 miles an hour. Just 30, 40, rushing through the city. You know. I mean, it's a horrible situation, and these patterns keep repeating themselves across the planet. So we have to decide our petty differences and come together, find common ground, and get the job done. Rally the realms, people. We can do it, especially if it's on this, like, repeating comet timeline. So we know where the storms are coming, and we know which areas are going to be heavily affected, and we know where the safe areas are. I mean, it's, it's pretty simple, but you just got to get the 313 plus 6 and to realize that the White Walkers are there, you know? I guess, or whatever. Anyway, love you guys. God bless you guys. And, uh, you know, just everybody get geared up for when government shuts down this weekend. All right, peace out. Stay cool.